What makes a great smartphone camera? Whether we want to admit it or not, most of us still believe that a higher pixel count equates with better image quality. The reasons for this are many, but let's just say that manufacturers did us no favors by marketing megapixel counts as heavily and pretty much exclusively. But a higher megapixel count does introduce advantages, but the reality is that diminishing returns kick in real fast. That is, a 5 megapixel image is more than big enough for a clear print on an A4 paper and certainly sufficient for sharing on social media. More than that should not necessarily be considered an advantage. So why is that? Well, when you cram as many pixels on a relatively small sensor, that comes at the expense of pixel size, which is a pretty important consideration when talking image quality. Indeed, the smaller the pixel, the less accurately it can measure light bouncing off of it, and thus, the more noisy and less clear the resulting picture is. That's why, all things being equal, smartphones with larger sensors are better suited for shooting in the darkness. Again, and folks remember this part, cramming as many pixels as possible in a smartphone may be a good way to advertise and sell a device, but does not necessarily mean a better image quality. So which are the smartphones that offer the biggest camera sensors on the planet? We've got the answer, let's check them out. Counting in reverse, the Nokia Lumia 1520 comes in last with a nevertheless big 1-2.5 inch type sensor. Nokia crammed 20 megapixels within that and also included two LED lamps and f2.4 lens. Next up is the Nokia Lumia 1930 or Lumia Icon, which comes with the same 1-2.5 inch type sensor with 20 megapixels, two LED flashes and f2.4 lens. Samsung's first camera phone, the Galaxy S4 Zoom, comes with even bigger 1-2.3 inch type sensor with 16 megapixels, a Xenon flash and f3.1 through f17.8 lenses. The successor to the Galaxy S4 Zoom is called the Galaxy K Zoom and inherits the same 1-2.3 inch type sensor but with 20.7 megapixels crammed within. The unit is complemented by a Xenon flash and f3.1 through f6.3 lens. The Blue Life Pure XL is an unlikely entrant but it comes with a 1-2.3 inch type sensor with 16 megapixels, an LED flash and unknown lens. Most of the recent Sony Z-Line devices, including the Z1, the Z2 and the Z3, also come with a 1-2.3 inch type sensor with 20.7 megapixels, f2.0 lens and an LED flash. Meizu's two flagships, the MX4 and the MX4 Pro, both come with a Sony-made 1-2.3 inch sensor with 20.7 megapixels, two LED flashes and f2.2 lens. The bronze medal today goes to the Nokia Lumia 1020 with its giant 1-1.5 inch type sensor with the whopping 41 megapixels. The camera is complemented by an LED plus Xenon flash combo and f2.2 lens. The runner-up of our list today is another Nokia device, the now ancient PureView 808. It's got an enormous 1-1.2 inch type sensor with 41 megapixels, f2.4 lens and a Xenon plus LED flash combo. And the award for the planet's largest camera sensor ever put into a smartphone goes to no other than Panasonic's Lumix CM1. This monster has a 1-inch sensor which is 7 times bigger than the average smartphone found in our database. The CM1's camera has 20 megapixels to work with along with an LED flash and f2.8 through f11 lens. As far as image sensor size go, you can do no better than the Lumix CM1 at this point in time.